Hi guys, Nick Miller today from Mark Supply Company. Today I have for you a 2015 Big Tex 22GN heavy duty trailer. Um, so this is our own personal, I mean this was owned by our company. Uh, I went to a hydraulic folding tail. Um, I have not pulled this trailer since June of last year until here just recently. Um, got it ready, I'm going to sell it. Uh, we are just not using it. It's been sitting here on our lot. Um, it is a 25 plus 5 plus five foot ramp. So it is a 30 foot gooseneck trailer, 23.9 GVWR. I ordered a trailer new from All Pro Trailers out of Mechanicsburg, PA in like December of 14. Never got the trailer until like April or May it was of 15. And we put a brand new truck behind it at that time. Um, and I traded that truck last June and it had 23 or 24,000 miles on it. And it was never unhooked from this trailer other than a few times. So that is the miles on the trailer. We haul a lot of compacts, many excavators, uh, and some you know skid loader stuff is what we primarily do. So trailer is in very good shape. Um, from setting, that's any complaint I have about big techs, their paint does not hold up the greatest. I had two of these, one I pulled in the winter, one I kept out of the salt. This is the one I kept out of the salt. The other one I pulled in the winter time. Um, I have sold two years ago. Rub rails are all straight. I have one ding right here. It got bumped and I know exactly where it happened at. Um, other than that, rub rails are straight. 48 inch spread. All rubber matches. Um, 235 ADR 16s on Dexter oil bath 10K axles with the Dexter electric brakes. Drum style brake. Dirt shedder on the rear. I did do the three ramp, which I don't know why a guy wouldn't. All LED lights. I have side step on both sides. Turn signal on both sides in the middle. Um, again, it is from setting. Paint is starting to peel and chip. It is not a trailer. It's been in the salt. It's not eight up. Um, it's just big Texas paint wasn't, in my opinion, the best. The, the earlier one I had was three times as worse. But <clears throat> again, oil bath axles. All my spring hangers are excellent. Axles are excellent. See up there, the frame is still shiny paint. Deck's in good shape. Um, you can see this trailer's never hauled heavy. These are all straight. There's no bows in them. My dirt shedders are straight. You can see my ramps. All my angles are straight. Never hauled any track stuff, anything like that, or steel track stuff, I should say. Never hauled a dozer. Um, 102 wide, 25 foot of flat, 5 foot of beaver tail, 5 foot of ramp. And when you flip the ramps up, it goes to a wedge. I did add on this trailer a angle iron up here for a chain rack and then down here we added two little anchors and then we kept our binders in here and the strap across to keep them from clanging around and we did weld in a chain rack here so <clears throat> dual leg landing gear drop legs something I really like on this trailer it had this adjustable coupler so you can actually has a, a star style bolt here that uh, grips into the neck and then you can adjust it where you want. I did lengthen out our gooseneck chain, safety chains, breakaway, 2 and 5 sixteenths coupler. It is currently state inspected and ready to go. <clears throat> Any questions, 814-658-366. This is something that I own myself. This is not something we bought to sell. We are an equipment dealer. This was our own, own trailer. So if you have any questions, 814-658-3066. Please check out our website, www.marksupplyco.com. As always, thanks for checking out Mark Supply Company. Have a great day.